Oh shit! I need to leave Fort Mercer, and there is a gosh darn Zombago army out here. This is ridiculous. Oh, there's one of those squirrely motherfuckers down there now. Look at that guy. That one right there crawls at you like it's the damn exorcist. Welcome everybody to Zombago Nightmare. I believe we're on episode four now, and if you haven't checked out the first few episodes, feel free to check out the playlist in the description. Don't you? No, 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 no. You go. I'm gonna. I'm gonna try and find a side of this where there aren't zombagos. Hopefully, uh, Fort Mercer is a pretty cool safe zone, though. Um, let's see here. But today, oh, we need to. Oh God! We need to go to Tall Trees for Nigel to collect some materials. And for those of you. That know what Tall Trees is. It's a it's a rather terrifying place in Red Dead Redemption 2. Full of Skinners and stuff like that. Now imagine Skinner zombies. I have no idea. Skinners and zombies, maybe? That's even more of a terrifying thought. Oh, God, I'm going to break my damn legs. But I hope you all enjoy the episode. Last time, just as I arrived to Fort Mercer, one of the mythical horses spawned uh, just outside Fort Mercer, and then I got attacked by a cougar army and died. I was so very, very upset about it. Uh, but I live and learn. Uh, next time I'm not going to get off my horse if I find a mythical horse until I know everything around it is dead. Oh, okay, so Fort... Uh, not Fort Mercer. We need to go to Tall Trees. There is also some graveyards that we need to clear, some towns that we still need to save, and we can use these towns as fast travel locations. So I think we're going to take care of Armadillo on our way up to Tall Trees. There's another thing there. I could fast travel to here, I suppose, and maybe take down uh, Manzanita Post. But I know I'm going to need to get back down here anyways. So we're just going to go to Armadillo and save this lovely town. All right, Armadillo, you cholera-infested village from hell. What do we got going on up in here? We got... Oh, we got ammo for days with the repeater. Nice. We could take this place. Oh, look at Tubby McTubberson here, just waddling its way to death. The official death. Oh, get out of here, Bork Borks. I ain't messing with you. <laughs> Bork Borks are bad in this game. Oh, God. That is a plethora of zombies, so we can mark with R1. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, what the hell? I still maintain that it's easier... To use Deadeye if you just um, go in and out of Deadeye. And that's pretty much what I do in... Oh, oh, the squirrely ones! No, 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 no! No, thank you, sir. Ain't dealing with no squirrely-ass zombies today. Good God, what's this guy doing? They're just chilling. Damn zombos. We also have an... Oh, oh, God. No, no, no. Imagine, like... Undead Nightmare for Red Dead Redemption 2 would be crazy, because your horses don't spook in Red Dead Redemption 1, so you can't get knocked off. But imagine for Red Dead Redemption 2 having this, where you could theoretically get pulled off of your horse by zombies. Your, uh, like your horses will spook and buck you off and be traitors. Oh, what the? Did somebody just get the shit eaten out of them? Shoot that zombie in the butthole. Oh, that's a lot of zombies. Oh! Oh, God! Okay, you can get pulled off on this one, too! Jesus! No! Found that out. Oh, God, there's so many zombies! Oh, God, no, there's creepy. Oh, God, no! Oh, this is terrible! Oh, there's big-ass knockdown zombies here, too. Jesus Christ, Armadillo, you s Oh, my God, no! 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 <laughs> no, Jeff! Oh, no! <laughs> Armadillo can suck my butt! Damn it! Oh god, that guy just got the sh Oh, there's so many! Oh, this sucks so bad! <laughs> no! 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 Oh god! Please! Somebody help me! I know I'm supposed to be saving the town, but damn! God! Please! Oh, you have an axe in your head! Ah, God! Jesus Christ! So now I know you can get pulled off your horse. God, Armadillo can suck my butt. 
Those creepy exorcist zombies, man. I didn't I didn't sign up for this. No 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 no. Oh god! Jesus! You have no head, I hope. You squirrely ass zombie. Mm -mm. I was trying to get a two for one special there. God. Okay, just a few left. No! Bad zombie! Don't you do it, you prick! Now you got no zombie head. How do you feel about yourself? I just shot him in the dick like four times! Goodbye! Oh! That was. That was intense. I was not anticipating that being such a crate. I, well, we should have known because everybody in Armadillo died of cholera at one point. So, of course, there would be a ton of zombies here, right? Cholera infested zombies from hell, nonetheless. Okay. Learn, live and learn. Barely lived, but learned a lot. I can get pulled off of my horse. There's a treasure chest in here somewhere, but I don't rightly know how to get to it. It might be upstairs, or was it outside? Is it on the roof? Can I get to the roof? I feel like maybe if I get on this barrel... Nope. Oh my god. Alright, we'll have to figure that out. We got some guys screaming over here, though. There is a side quest. Let's check out what's going on up in here. Is it the sheriff? I shot the sheriff. Oh god! Let him go. Come on, boy. Hey. Well, try to. <gasps> is that who I think it is? Oh, God. What is the sheriff doing? Sorry, boys. She didn't give me a whole lot of choice. Hello, John. Welcome to paradise. Hello, Marshal. <laughs> Might have known you'd survive. What's going on? Do I look like I commune with the undead? I don't know. Well, then how would I know? My job is to take care of the folk who live here. Oh, you <laughs> heard that one. How's that going? How's that going? Well, let me put it to you this way. Cattle rustling and bank robbery are at an all-time low. But murder... Blood drinking and psychotic episodes seem to be somewhat prevalent. Either that, or I'm dreaming. That's what I'm hoping too. How was it getting in here? It was crazy. Absolutely crazy. I must be hiding again. I almost pooped myself. I come in and I wear my brown just pants. disappear. The town's been nearly overrun a couple of times. Now we're low on ammunition, and I'm two men down. I'll help you clear the place out if you like. You're a good man, John Marston. But before that, I'm gonna need my deputies back. What happened I'll... to them two clowns you had before? Gone? Maybe. I sent huh. Jonah off to look for Eli. They've both been gone for several hours now. Who'd want to eat one of them? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good question. Where'd you send them? Out near the general store. Jonah's got one of these new guns. I'm sure he can't run into any trouble. Oh. These things, they'd stop an elephant. Oh. Thank you. you had me a hello. Thank you. You had me a I'm new sure gun. you got your own troubles. That's exciting. So that's a sawed-off shotgun, I do believe. Now, is that going to be better... Uh, then the regular shock. There are so many dead zombos here. Look for Jonah and Eli in and around Armadillo. Dark days indeed. <laughs> dark, dark day. Oh, don't run me over, you pricks. God, imagine this game in Red Dead Redemption 2 would be just an absolute terrifying shit show. It would be amazing. What's that dude doing in there? Is that a... Is that one of the people... Grit the body! Turn around, John! You this suck at this! I don't want to think about. Damn it, John. All that for one repeater, Emma. You gotta be shitting me. Alright, who's up in the church? Hello! Hey! It's the deputy. Maybe? 
What you doing there, home skillet? Okay. Mayhaps it was not the one I was looking for. I forgot what they look like already. I actually need to get back into doing the Red Dead Redemption 1 series. Um, and I've been meaning to. I've just been so caught up with the Atlas, uh, with Atlas and the Atlas servers running them that I really have not been able to do a lot of other things. And I'm sorry for that. Uh, I know I've been prioritizing a lot of stuff with Atlas and um, the series isn't doing very well on the channel, but I'm having so much fun playing with it playing it with the community that uh, I really just don't want to stop because it is a lot of fun and if you guys are interested feel free to check out the series on the channel we've got a massive community server and now that the game is stabilized and everything is working as it should be the game is actually really fun uh, so if you have it and you haven't played since release or you're interested in it I, I'd recommend it now because it's um gotcha. It's a lot cheaper than it's going to be on official release. We're going to have mods soon. There's going to be a lot of really nice things coming for that game. So, I don't know. I, I, I'm enjoying it. But we need to find these guys. I'm also going to loot some of the stuff that's around. Need a couple deputies nearby. Marshall's boys. Jonah and Eli. Are they Jews, mister? They sound like Jews. Well, I don't know. okay. Why? Why? <laughs> this whole thing is nothing but a Jewish plot. You do know that, don't you? I find that highly unlikely, amigo. Well, I don't like Jews. Or colored folk. Or natives, now that you mention it. Well, you're a nice, kind-hearted man to meet in a time of trouble. Kind does not come into it. Why? What are you talking about? Why? <laughs> I bet you like Catholics. I can't stand them neither. Nor women. Fabians, socialists, homosexuals, Asians, or British. Between them, they've ruined this country. Ruined it. It was a good country once. Now people are eating each other. And it's all the fault of the Jewish, British, Catholic, homosexual elite and their ideas. Well, I, for one, won't stand for it. Have you ever met a Jewish person? <laughs> Thankfully not. Or, uh, wow. British, Catholic, homosexual? Not in my store. Oh, I, I get it. I see you acting clever. Well, let me tell you this. The Jews killed Lincoln. That's why there is a triangle on the money. And they run Europe like one of them Arabian harems. Now they've sent this here plague to kill all us decent folk. Yep. You, sir, are truly a remarkable fella. Thank you kindly. I must say, it's a rare pleasure to meet someone with such a grasp on human history. You take care of yourself. I'd hate to see you get savaged by someone and watch the life force drain from your hate-filled body. <laughs> hey, Can I do that? Hold on there. Why don't you join me in my fight, sir? It's not too late. I fear it is for me. Then I will fight them alone. All of them. America is the land of the free, and that means free to people like me, Herbert Moon. Absolutely. Herbert Moon has lived for so long. No. Oh, no, no, no. oh, he's finally dying. Oh, Herbert Moon. Huh. I guess that deal with the devil didn't save him from the zombies. Saved him from cholera, but not the zombos. Whoops. Oh, God. Oh, God. I like this gun. Stupid zombies. The reload on it is amazing. The zombie just moved. It was going to become a super zombie. Oh, God. Okay, so they're not here, but maybe they're in this giant ass house that looks like it would definitely be filled with zombies. It's the bar. The Zombo bar. I, I can't believe Herbert Moon actually died. So there, uh, I, I made a video about Herbert Moon and the strange man. These are both things that you find in Red Dead Redemption 1 and Red Dead Redemption 2. And if you're curious to know more, feel free to check out that episode. 
Um, it's, it's pretty cool. I actually really enjoyed making that episode. Um, but let's see here. Maybe they're up in here getting their groove on or something? I, I don't know. Whoa! Where the hell are you guys? There are some weird noises up in here. What the hell's going on in here? What are you doing? I had a dream about a dead coming back. <gasps> oh, it's her. What are you doing up there? Can we have a chat? We've got some zombos out here. I wonder. Oh, no. Hello, boys. Marshall sent me and needs what some help. What do you mean, hello, boys? Guess you got other plans. Seriously. Enjoy your meal, no problem. Damn it, John! Easy now, gentlemen. Remember all the fun times we had? <laughs> I guess not. <laughs> no! I miss the old times, fellas. And stay dead. I think you were dumber when you were alive. Ooh, I think got ammo on them though. So I guess we're not going to tall trees this today. Is this is faulty. Things have gone awry here. We got some zombos out here, and we need to actually make sure to keep towns cleared out because they can be overrun again. Which means we would have to deal with that damn nightmare we just had again. There we go. We're getting a lot better at this red dead or undead nightmare shenanigan sh shenaniganry. Wow, words are hard. Hello, John. He almost Hello, shot Marshall. my ass. So. You find the boys? I found them. Don't give them the gun back. Oh, it was fast for them. It was fast. And they died with their bellies full. Well, one of them did. Good. That there's Jonah's gun. Here, you keep it. Thank God. After all, you earned it. Thank you. <sighs> Take care of yourself, John. You too, Marshal. Good old Marshall. Are we, uh, is that going to be the last time we do anything with the Marshall? Dinner for two completed. Listen to that music. Oh, that's unfortunate. I, I like the Marshall. So we've got this town saved, and let's see what else we got going on around here. Uh, let's see here. So, I suppose we could save Twin Rocks. Or we could clear out a graveyard, which we need to do for Seth. Let's see here. There's there's more graveyards. They're all the way over here. I suppose we should continue with the graveyard plates here. Because that is necessary to be able to continue anything with Seth, I believe. Come here, horse. We also need a zombie horse. I really wish I should loot those two bodies, but they don't really ever give that much ammo. And I'm doing pretty good on ammo right now. Famous last words, right? What the... What? Hey, buddy. Uh. It just twitched. I saw it twitch! Whoa! 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 Ah! Is he gonna turn into a zombie now, too? We got revolver ammo. Did he mean to shoot himself in the face, or, did, or was that an accident? I think it was, I think we like glitched it out where the zombie made him shoot himself in the face. That, that was a weird interaction. Something tells me this one's gonna suck. If it's near Armadillo, Armadillo sucked. I guarantee this one's gonna suck too. I don't know, somebody said you can instant kill zombies with the, uh, with the torch. I have not been able to figure out how to do that. I keep having to pimp slap them with it, and they run around on fire trying to chase me down and light my ass on fire, and they more often than not succeed. Burn, baby, burn. Zombie inferno! Is there going to be another crazy talking zombie here? Probably. Let's be honest. That's, that's my life. The real question is, how did Seth manage to befriend zombies? That's like a terrifyingly creepy... Oh god, no, that's not how we do it. Okay, uh, I'm just not gonna try and instant kill people with zombies, but we can't- I'M ON FIRE! 
We should be able to lure them into the car, into the fire coffins though, which makes life just a little bit easier at the very least. Oh my God. Target. Boop. And boop. There we go. I still feel it takes way longer to do that than it does to just to boop them like this. Oh my God, I missed. I missed again. Oh, three times. Well, the episode was going really well until that happened. No, 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 no. Slow your roll there, home skillet. I definitely like running up to them and shooting them that way. It's just so quick and efficient. Oh, God. Nope, not today, madame, I think. I'm not 100% sure. As long as there's not a mass of people, like, this is just quick and... Oh, God, squirrely ones. Damn it. No, no. Bad squirrely zombie. Get your ass on the ground. I will shoot you in the brown star. Peter Turner. Okay. I don't want to date with the devil. No. Oh, God. I respectfully decline. No. Tubby McTubberson, you back that fat ass up. Stupid zombies. Who said you could yell at me like that? I'll shoot you in the butthole. You stay dead. Most vulnerable spot for a zombie. We did it. Shine a light down on me. Odd fellow's rest has been cleansed. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Time to get some loot. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that does bring us to the end of today's episode. I hope you all enjoyed it. We will be trying to get the four horsemen, horses of the apocalypse. Definitely keep an eye out on the channel for those episodes. We'll probably be happening, you know, while we're doing our just general let's play. Uh, but we will be bringing more Red Dead Redemption 1 and 2 content to the channel. So if you're new and want to see more, feel free to subscribe. And if you enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. It really helps out. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one.